All right, we are live. So today, I will explain my challenge. It's very simple, and I will explain what I'm actually aiming for, why am I doing it, what it consists, and then we will move to the challenge. Um, and before we start off, since it's actually fresh, um, I might tag people afterwards, but I'm not going to tag anybody yet. The reason why, it's fresh. So let's see what we can actually do for this Unity Challenge. That's how I call it. And it's to prove, now, what is the Unity Challenge? What is it going to consist? Or why am I doing this? Well, I've seen a lot of challenges out there about people, like, you know, there's, there's so many, I can't name them. Um, but this is something that we all, as human beings, have, and part of, and you know, there is so many, 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 many things you can do. So, to raise awareness on mental health, I mean, when I say mental health, it could be happiness. It could be your mental state, any mental state, any physical state. If you can move, if you have one leg, if you have, you know, uh, a couple of fingers missing, a couple of extra fingers, whatsoever. It's to raise awareness about how we're not so different. If your neighbor is somebody who's suffering from anything, if your neighbor is happy, if your neighbor whatsoever, this is going to prove a lot of people that we can actually be one. And it's, it'll be very simple. So, now that we got that covered, we're going to see what it consists, or maybe why. Uh, the reason why is I see so many, so many challenges and it's, it's hard to actually swallow. For example, mental health being associated with physical strength, there's a lot of people who want to understand that you're meant to being doing push-ups for example it takes a lot of mental uh, discipline now it is hard to swallow that sometimes yeah I to raise awareness on people's mental state and physical state has to go through by doing something maybe people can't really do or have a difficult time, or is actually have a poor self-esteem. Now, what is my challenge? It'll be very simple. Any music instrument. Now you're gonna be like, what, what? Yes, music. And it's not to scare people off. It's not to, hey, everybody has either a toy. This is actually a ukulele. It's not really a toy. Or, you know, in my case, a guitar. People can have piano, any, any, anything. Saxophone, you know. Uh, and it's to basically do, my challenge is a scale. Simple as that. Now, I'll be doing it on the guitar, and I'll be doing, uh, exercise scale that I'll be doing and I'm gonna dim it up really so that to prove you guys that it's possible and the reason why I'm doing exactly all of this and to prove to you right now before I even do it how many people did you or how many songs do you hear about depression love excitement you know, people who's suffering about trying to do something. 
Now, second part is basically how many musicians do you see that has limbs missing? Look at Def Leppard, one-handed drummer. I seen people with missing fingers playing the guitar as well and as perfect as somebody who has all their five fingers, you know, playing strings. Or ten, but you know what I mean? I seen a lot of people who has uh, for example, one best, best, best example I'll use. There's one little girl who actually sang a song. Now, you guys are probably going to laugh, but hey, this person had Down syndrome. And Down syndrome, they have problem with their memory and stuff like that, apparently. How true it is, or is it? I have no idea. I am not in that person's body. But that person got into the soul of music, of music and was able to pull it off and it's a challenge and I'm not saying to learn a song and play it no I'm actually saying a scale what is a scale you will see uh, for example uh, I'm gonna be using guitar and there's scales you know I'll be doing a training scale now for people that wants to use uh, strings, uh, not just strings, but wind instruments, xylophone, piano, do one scale. It's going to practice you by giving you self-confidence of you can do it. How fast can you do it? How well will you master this scale? Etc, etc. And if you are suffering for anxiety, it might help your anxiety out to relax. If you're, if you're feeling depressed and you try this, you will actually feel less depressed because you are actually succeeding. And if you actually feel anything, you know, love, you're going to be loving it anyway. So, you know, all of these feelings or mental state I should say is possible and if you are actually having you know like I said an extra limb uh, you know missing fingers what not it's still possible I've seen it happening many 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 times and it's going to be very simple as long as you have two fingers I think you'll be able to. So, I'll be using three fingers just to actually ease the, just to make it a little bit, you know, challenging for myself. Um, so once again, it's to raise, it's to raise awareness of we are one. No matter if you're suffering, no matter if you're missing something, or if you have something extra. You will see that this challenge, if it hits big, like I want people to actually tag famous people, people that actually is in music, people that never even touched an instrument. For example, you know, a guitar, anybody could actually do this. And it doesn't need to be perfect at all. It's just to be able to do it. Once you did it, hey, I did it. And I won't be pushing people to do it for X many days, but in my case, I'll take I'll count to how many press there is on this ukulele, and that's how many days I'll do it. How many days you will do it? It's depend on you. If you are really really good, you can do it once and say, "Hey, it's done." There's a lot of people who's busy too. We have to actually be united and understand each other. Never mind bashing each other for this one. So, I'll do it in front of you guys. So, three, six, and 12 days. So, as you can see, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. So, I'll be doing scales for 12 days. I won't be using a ukulele because, well, 
it'd be a little bit boring for my for me personally. I will be using my guitar. And the type of skill I'll be using, I'm gonna practice my pinky. So that's what I'll be doing. So I hope that people watch this. Tag somebody into this video. It's gonna go on to my YouTube channel and I'll be you know bouncing in social media as well. So like I have I'll be posting some short videos on TikTok, I'll be posting uh, on here live and transferring my live onto YouTube. So enjoy. I hope somebody will actually start the chain for me because it would mean a lot to me because I suffered a lot of different types of mental health issues. I've actually seen a lot of people suffer from different mental health issues. I live with some people who actually had mental issues. I've lived with some people who had limb issues too. My daughter has double thumb. Do you think that she'll be able to play? And I will tell you this. Just because she has two thumbs, I'm pretty sure she could actually just hold her grip on here and you know. I don't have need thumb. If you have just those two fingers, you can do it. If you have just two fingers, you can still do it. So to me, and if you have a different type of mus yeah, music instrument, would be interesting as well. The only thing is, don't don't do a drum cover of this, please, because it, it's I won't understand, and people won't truly understand what you're doing, because you know, let's keep it a little simple. So that's going to be challenging for some people. Might tag a few drummers or you know see if they can actually come up with their interpret anyways their version of this challenge so as promised here goes and I have 22 frets so it's gonna be from the first fret to the last one this is an exercise scale and whoever that's a musician who is playing guitar who wants to participate I'm gonna actually challenge you right now to do a full scale and it's actually an exercise scale that I'm asking. I'm not saying, you know, do something crazy. Just a, some, just an exercise, you know? And any sound quality, any uh, tone, I have Rocksmith, so that's how I'm gonna use it. If you wanna use the pedal, if you wanna use, you know, different type of setups awesome let's spread the love and care for everybody that it is mental state or physical state because in reality we're all human and let me tell you you have positive and negative into the music world there's some people who created music for peace and love look at john lennon and there's some people who actually created for less uh, fortunate events. For example, I can name Trivium. If you really want to know what uh, the song, it would be a head, uh, gunshot, uh, a gunshot to the head of trepidation. And it talks about abuse. So, and it's child abuse, whatever. No matter, I don't understand too much. I didn't go in details and search the song, but I know that I would support that song because it's, it doesn't say continue it, it says stop. So here goes. And I'm not going to be perfect. I'm not hitting perfection. I'm just going to prove you guys that it's possible. So here goes. Bye. 
there you have it. As simple as that. And the people who believe that, you know what, I can't do it, let me actually do a short, tiny piece of two fingers. simple as that. If you have two fingers, you know somebody with a guitar, you can actually participate in this challenge. And it's gonna, I'm trying to make it big so people understand that do you know what, it doesn't matter what you're going through, no matter how you look, no matter how hard it is for you, no matter what. We're all in, in this together, we're all equal, and guess what? Just because your neighbor did something, but he's still as equal as you. Now let's stop the negativity, let's share this, and be united, and be there for each other, and stop hurting each other. Peace and love, and I hope people start tagging people in here, it'd be interesting. That's my first, if you want, nominee would be to, for you guys to tag somebody in here you think that would actually be interesting to try. No matter if it's girl, boy, band, artist, no matter what, I hope that people enjoy this and gets true life in certain ways.